Hello, welcome back to Let's Play Cave Story. This is Drake Lord 56, the hero you're better off without. Well, we saved Kazuma, made it here to the sand zone, and did something we aren't especially proud of. And now we're following this one pathway here. Kind of found a little shortcut here. Up. Up. <laughs> leveled out and I leveled back up. Weird faces on these things. Ooh, health! I'm liking that sight. Up. Oh, hello, I see presents. Bring about the sand gator. Hmm. Ah! Asshole. Eh, this looks like a dead end. That Belrog! He blundered yet another time! Hello, Misery. Glad to meet you. <sighs> you have a lot of spirits. However, to come all the way here, you're a bit troublesome. You want to take me on? I certainly do! What the? What this, what's that? Ah, uh, doesn't seem like it'll be necessary. Bye now! Get back here! Oh, what? What the heck is this? Charge Polar Star! How do you like that? This thing is a push on. It, it would have been over by now if that stupid ass. Oh, hello! You're jumping! Gotcha! <laughs> Take that! Love that explosion! Defeated Omega, even though we didn't really ask what his name was. The curse on the sunstones is lifted, whatever that means. Okay! That is awesome! Huh. Huh. Wow, son of a bitch! Stupid ass alligator! Give me the experience! Give it to me now! Now! Yes! Yes! Come on, there we are! Come on, yes! Well, you, you really split up a lot. There we are! Things are much more comfortable. Hello there, Spikes. I didn't think I would see it, did you? We don't encounter those things too many times. There we go, that's that's clearing everything out for us. Those must be the sunstones. Yeah, 
there, bouncing dinosaur thing. Wow, you dropped a lot of health for somebody who didn't really need it. You know, I think I saw some pop presents up here. What does that mean? Concussion! Okay. A dog! Okay. Cool. It's sitting on my head. Awesome! Yes! 36! I feel bad for the dog having its head drag across the ceiling like this. Okay. Hey there, old lady. How's it going? Oh, oh that's my doggy. You returned him to me. How does very nice of you? What? Red flower. Oh yeah. Uh <laughs> hey, Balrog. How you doing, Auntie? Oh, it's you, Bower. Wait, what? You know each other? You look good. How's my stupid daughter been lately? I assume she's talking about misery. <laughs> stupid daughter. You mean misery? Nailed it. She's also fun. A new master has appeared. This time, the surface will finally be out. Are you still trying to do that? I'm not here to cause any trouble. I just came by to pick up the key to the warehouse. You know, the warehouse with the f with the red flower seeds. <laughs> I have no idea what you're talking about. That's the you're just pretending that you you don't know. I see now. You're gonna betray us then. Is that it? You'll be sorry. A new master. Must be another idiot at it yet again. About my dogs. I have four more still. My little pups. But these legs are of mine are so very weak. So everything for convenience. But you wouldn't be mind finding the rest of my dogs for me? Shouldn't be you be more concerned about the dudes trying to break into the warehouse to get the seeds or whatever? What's in here? Nothing. Okay. All right, let's look for dogs then. Land right on those dino head things. That's quite a stockpile here. Hey, doggy, how's it going? I see you over there. Coming right your way. I assume this is going the right way. Okay, parrot, gish. Okay, so this place doesn't have those sand gators. Good to know. Yep, that thing was just head and legs. Yep, nope, you're not getting me. Hello, Paw Prince. That means the path is here. Here's doggy number two!
Handy dandy map. I see your way. Okay. Up. Completely botched that. Okay, keep on pressing the wrong button for that. Okay, I think I got it to the dog. Hey there, puppy! I wonder- Oh, crap! Holy crap! Dude, you suck! Ah, son of a bitch. Yes. Alright. Yes! That's much better! Stupid ass! Look at alligator, asshole! Yeah, need these. And thank God this pile, the stockpile re responds. Be a soldier from the surface. It's been a long time since all those robots, just like you, came to this island. They were responsible for the deaths of so many defenseless Mimika. As for the lives of brave men, and for the bleh, lives of the brave men and women who tried defending the Mimika, due to the effects of consuming the forbidden red flower, the corner of Mimika became utterly a rabbit. They fought back viciously against the robots that had invaded their island. Who knows? There had there been no red flower. It's very possible that Mimika on this island might have been annihilated. Three more left. I know you can do it. Okay. I wonder, does the map show where the rest of the dogs are? It does not. It just shows the absolute enormity of this entire place. I seem to remember a dog where, where the Curly is uh, hiding out at. Hey Curly, I'm just coming by to uh, pick up something. For real this time. Hey there, doggy. Uh... I don't think. Uh, mm. You don't seem to be the one of the dogs. Damn. Okay. I wonder. Maybe the maybe uh, you, you may know about him. He's sleeping. I think he's dreaming he's a calf. A real mother with one car killed long time ago by the robot, and she's the one who raised us, even before we could open her eyes. Ah! Huh. Be careful with the sand crocs. They yes, I know! They're assholes! Yeah, we know. Okay, okay, now we, we can pick up this dog. 
It's, now it's confirmed that it is Jenka's dog. All right. Still not trading. And nothing's missing from any secret area that I don't know about. It's dog number three, Jenka. Ooh, definitely. That one's mine. Thank you so much. This one makes three. Have you ever seen an enraged Mimiga? Three times! The, the one, uh, one that apparently didn't get it. Get footage of scared the crap out of me! Eating the red flower will make me stronger. A great many of the Mimiga believe this and chose to eat the red flower. Then, and only did they fight back against the battalions of robots. But, do you know what happens afterwards to a Mimiga still with such rage? From what I see, they uh, turn completely feral. It was so terrible. Perhaps they couldn't control themselves. Hell, oh, most of the Mimiga who consumed the red flower are never to be seen again. They went missing. I heard a rumor that they supposedly made it down to the surface. Where the humans live. The thought of enraged Mima anywhere close to the surface with humans. It's, if it's really true, you realize it? Do you realize how dangerous the red flower actually is? Yeah, so that's why we're, I'm trying to prevent this from happening. Two more pups. Alright, and, uh, and looking at the time, it's, yeah, it's getting pretty close to a. a, a the end of the episode, so I think we're gonna look for the last two dogs next time. So if you like this one, hit the like button, comment on it, and if you want to subscribe. So until next time, see you later!